attention public employees, teachers, uh, police officers, folks who are government employees, uh, windfall elimination provision is something you need to know about. If you don't know what it is, uh, spend about five minutes with me here. I'll outline it for you. Uh, for those of you who don't fall in one of those categories, maybe you have a spouse that is uh, still, you might want to pay attention to what's going on here because this can affect your retirement. Hi, welcome to the latest video. I'm Antonio Sabella with Vision Wealth Management. We're talking windfall elimination provision. Uh, it is a government provision that deals with social security and government pensions. So the short version here is if you work in a uh, government or public pension system that doesn't pay into social security, it's not covered, It doesn't. Uh, some of your check doesn't go to the social security system, it just goes into STRS or whatever the situation may be, your, your public pension. Uh, and you also have some money going into Social Security, maybe you have a side job or something, you worked uh, doing something else before you became a teacher, for example, uh, and it gets to retirement time, the government's going to reduce the amount of that Social Security check. They're going to offset it based on uh, what you've got coming in on your government pension. Uh, I know it doesn't sound fair. Uh, it's a conversation I have regularly with clients, which is exactly why I'm doing a video about it. Uh, and I'll explain a little bit of the reasoning why, and then we'll get into kind of how it works. So part of the reason why, we're going way back here. Uh, Social Security started in 1935 as part of the New Deal uh, with FDR, and it was designed to be a safety net program for those who would not have income in retirement. Now, most people then were covered by a pension. Social Security was designed to be a supplement to your retirement. And the way that it was done, there are, uh, is such a thing as uh, called a bend point in Social Security, how they calculate your check. Basically, they will replace more of your income if you're a low wage earner than they will if you're a high wage earner. Uh, and that's done on purpose. That's done so that those who maybe didn't earn a whole lot of money throughout their work career would still have uh, some money coming in in retirement. It would represent a higher dollar amount of what they earned versus somebody that did really well hopefully put other money away and put themselves in a good situation. So Social Security replaces a disproportionately larger amount of income for low wage earners. What does that have to do with windfall elimination provision? Well, if you had a little bit of money going to the Social Security system, but most of your income was not because it was a government system, before windfall elimination provision, Social Security was looking at you going, hey, they didn't make much money. We got to replace most of this money in retirement so that they've got something to get by. Meanwhile, you've got this government pension, and that's really where the retirement money is going to come from. So in 1983, Congress passed windfall elimination provision. It said if you get a government pension and you paid into that system and you didn't pay into Social Security from that money, we're going to reduce the amount of the Social Security check that you get. Uh, because otherwise we'd be uh, recreating a larger portion of that income uh, than maybe uh, we should if we didn't calculate in the pension. So that's the, the basis of how it works. Uh, the number of years that you have working in the Social Security system separate from the government system uh, has a, a, an impact on how much of the Social Security check they're going to reduce uh, versus how much you would get. Uh, it's a, a mind-numbing calculation. You can actually do it by hand nobody should do it by hand. There is a calculator on ssa.gov, uh, the WEP calculator, W-E-P, windfall elimination provision calculator. You can go there, plug in your information, and it'll show you how much the check is going to be reduced. Um, this is more of a PSA. We're not going to get into the specifics of how they're doing all of the math because it would bore you to death. But if you're subject to windfall elimination provision, if you've got a government pension and you think you're going to get a social security check, Get on that calculator, find out what it looks like, because you don't want to get to retirement thinking you've got more income coming in than what you're actually going to have. You pull the trigger on retirement, and then you regret it. If you have questions about this sort of thing, by all means, drop me a line, give me a call, uh, shoot me an email, happy to go over your situation with you. It's planning work that we do regularly for clients, um, because a lot of people are subjected to this. Uh, I thank you for being here. I hope you learned something today, and I'll see you soon.